is how to play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. And I have to warn everyone. Warning. What you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Sound good? Alright. That's... Sounds good to me. Today, if we hit the tips goal on this stream, yes, I will put on the vest. Listen. I'm super grateful that you guys have been so supportive recently, and we have 12 straight streams where we hit the vest goal. This is insane at this point. Um, I'm not expecting this to carry on much longer. Fuck you. You're a liar. Quite frankly, like, yeah, I'm a realist. And as much as I'd like to say, damn, it would be awesome if we hit the vest goal every day, I'm not expecting it. I'm not. And it happens. And I'm like, damn, this is crazy good. This is awesome. Thank you guys for the support, okay? Um, KSI tipped me five dollars. Here we go. He says, Can you not devour a large slice of cake in front of hundreds of people like last time? You're only asking for trouble and asking to be picked on by trolls. Come on, Phil, use your head. Face palm. KSI, do you not understand that no matter what I do, I w these idiots, that's what they do. They take no matter what it is, and they spin it into a toxic negative. Celebratory toast! Everyone, if you have a drink, raise your glass with me. Salud. Now, if I want to celebrate my birthday on stream, and my wife makes me an awesome cake, and she's like, yeah, I hope you enjoy the cake. You should have a piece on stream and share it with your, your viewers and have a good time in Animal Crossing. Why should I say, oh, you know what? I can't do that. I can't have fun on my stream because some shithead might make fun of me. Who gives two flying fucks about those pieces of human garbage? I don't. I'm good at lying. <laughs> I'm not going to, to, to now nerf myself. On what stuff I can do on my stream because of these shitheads. <clears throat> okay? People are like, yeah, we'd love to see a piece of the cake that, that Kat makes for you for your birthday. We'd love to celebrate your birthday with you and have a good a good night stream there. So why am I going to say, oh, no, I'm not doing it. Because I'm afraid that some, you know, toxic fucking ninny on the internet might make fun of me. Oh. Oh, man, yeah. I'm just going to edit my whole fucking life for them. No, really. I mean, definitely what I should do is just live in a fucking uh, bubble wrap. I'm going to, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to wrap my body completely in bubble wrap, and I'm going to come on stream, and I'm only going to use, like, family-friendly words, and I'm only going to play, like, very, very safe games. You know, like, games where there's no risk involved, no challenge. Um, it's going to be, like, the most PG. In fact, I'm going to PG stream. It's going to be a G-rated stream. <clears throat> zero risk, zero reward, boredom. That's what I'm going to do from now on, all right? These are great, a great idea, because that's definitely me, right? <laughs> not at all. Um, you know, stupid is stupid. I'm not. I'm not going to change my life because of the actions of these shitheads. All right? If I want to have fun on my fucking birthday, I'll have fun on my birthday. Especially because last year, I didn't get to celebrate my birthday at all. I was en route to Connecticut uh, during my birthday. So I didn't get to do anything. And this year, goddammit, I want to have some fun on my birthday. So I'm going to. D damned to be the trolls who think that they're going to fuck that up for me. Seriously. <clears throat> so that's my attitude towards it. Okay. The mentality of a five-year-old. Now this is hilarious. Someone named China Virus tipped a dollar and says, you make fun of people by saying you won't edit your life for trolls, but at the same time you're afraid to do a house tour. You won't be doing dating missions and games and you hid your cat for a month. You need to be honest. Sure, I'll be honest. Okay. I won't do a house tour, not because uh, of the fact that, you know, oh no, trolls are going to say something, but because previously when I've done house tours, trolls have actually seen things in the videos and use those things to actually concretely hurt me in the real world. I gave this example before, <clears throat> okay? One time, I did a house tour, all right? And I accidentally had a utility bill sitting on my countertop. The trolls contacted the utility company, pretended to be me on the phone, and told them to shut off my power, okay? <laughs> this is not an exaggeration. This happened about, I want to say, three years ago, all right? Now, thank God, I have a thing set up that if there's any changes with any of my, my utilities, I get a message via email. So I got an email saying, thanks for your request to shut off your power. It'll be processed in two days. Uh, what the fuck? 
So I called them and I was like, what's going on? They're like, what, you didn't request this? I was like, no. And they're like, okay, we got a phone call saying, you know, shut off your power. I was like, well, that's not me. Someone's impersonating me. And please, let's set up something from now on so that no one can just call in just because they know my address or whatever. So that's what we did. Um, but that's just one example. All right. Over the years, people have found those those videos of house tours and done crazy shit as a result of those videos. So I'm sorry, guys. You know, again, in the, my previous years being a content creator, I was able to be a lot more transparent and open and share a lot more with you. I can't do it anymore because people are fucking crazy on the Internet and do fucked up stuff. I can't. All right. It has nothing to do. With, oh, a trolling action. Ha ha. Someone made a video and made fun of me. That's a concrete thing that can fucking hurt me because of something in a video. All right. <clears throat> Now, dating missions and games are my personal preference. I don't feel that they add anything to my content, and I'm old enough that I don't care about them anymore. I'm too mature for that shit, and I'm married, and I don't give a fuck about virtual romance in a video game, so I'm not going to be participating in that kind of stuff in a game. I'm a mature adult with a business degree. <laughs> that has nothing to do with trolls at all. That's my own personal preference, okay? Hiding my cat for a month. First of all, I didn't hide my cat for a month. I had a cat for a while before I revealed it to the stream. I felt that if I immediately let you guys know about that stuff during a time when I knew so much shit was going on. For example, I knew during that time period I was going to have a lot of issues going on with taxes. I knew I was going to be making eventually a trip to see my parents. I knew that because of that trip to see my parents that probably I was going to be getting married. I knew a million other things were going on. And to basically tell you guys everything and being fully transparent about that stuff... Again, it's not that, oh, a troll would make a video about my cat. It's that I thought people would concretely try to do things to hurt me. What would happen if people knew that I had a cat? Would they try to fucking do crazy shit like break into my goddamn house and steal a cat? You know, I don't know what was going to happen. You guys got to understand something. <laughs> wow. I've been DDoS attacked. I've been swatted. I've had crazy shit happen to me in real life that I don't tell you guys about because it's scary shit that I don't want people to even know about. So... You know, I have to take these precautions. This is not, oh, a troll made a video about me. This is serious shit. You know, life-threatening shit in some cases. It could disrupt my business. It could disrupt my life because of the things these crazy fuckers do to me on the internet. What? Okay, prove it. And there's no proof whatsoever. It's just completely, you know, things that are based on snippets of fact that are completely spun out of proportion and not true whatever. It's a very different thing than what you think. That's the thing. People just think, ah, oh, you know, it's nothing. It's no big deal. People just get trolled a little bit. No, my life has been rattled and fucking disrupted many times due to the actions of these crazy ass people on the internet. You don't understand because I don't talk about it constantly because I don't want my streams to be about that. And quite frankly, some of the stuff is scary to the point where you don't want people to even know that it's possible. All right. Just being honest. <clears throat> so please understand that. All right. Um, so no, China virus, stupid racist idiot. No, that's not the case. You're a dumb fuck. But thanks for the dollar tip, you stupid idiot. We have reached vest streak number 13. That's awesome, guys. Thank you very much for the support. 13 straight streams where we hit the tips go. Let me put on the vest for you. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> ah, thank you, guys. <laughs> we may not look excited to put it on. I told you, the vest, the vest has been making me play games better. <laughs> Seriously. Remember I was playing Neo 2 the other day? I lost to the Owl Boss like four or five times. I put the vest on one immediately. That's what it's all about, man. All right. So, thank you for hitting the tip skull. And the vest, the vestival continues. <laughs> thank you for that, guys. I keep forgetting to play the horn whenever I get a good, uh, a good tip. Any moment, I can pick up a controller. And I can play any game at professional level. I dodged! It didn't work! I dodged it! It didn't work! I pressed it. She was in the dodge animation and got hit out of it. What the fuck did they put a dodge in the game for? She was in the dodge and got hit anyway. Oh my gosh, she's already caution. Oh, fuck off. I thought he ran in a straight line. No, he goes around corners. Oh my god. This is very frustrating. I dodged and still got hit. Very frustrating. So essentially, you can't outrun it. What you need to do is wait and do the proper dodge to, to dodge every attack. You can't outrun and stay around the corner. It doesn't work because he tracks you. 
No, I cannot pick up any controller and play any game at a professional level. I tried to dodge to the side, it doesn't work. It can't do anyway. The flame, the atmospheric flames in the area are annoying as fuck. Worked, you can beat the boss easily, but the dodge does nothing. He hits you right through it. <laughs> We're gonna make a Resident Evil remake where there's a dodge mechanic, and then the dodge doesn't do anything during the boss fights. Oh. Hmm. I can tell you, I can smell the saltiness. For some reason, I'm in danger, even though it barely touched me. This sucks. cheered and said, oh my god, I figured it out. It all makes sense now. The reason you've had difficulty with games all these years is because you couldn't see. Put those glasses on, Phil. It's for your own good. Here we go again with this stupid glasses meme. He's still not dead? He's still not fucking dead after all of that. He's still not dead. That was what, 12, 15 shotgun shots to the heart? And he's still alive. I can't see. This is garbage. want me to do this stupid thing. I have no ammo left. <laughs> oh my fucking god. I, I don't know what else to do. I can't knock it off. You need the mine rounds. Without the mine rounds, you can't knock it off the wall. This sucks. This is the worst boss fight in a long time. They're complete idiots. Like, what the fuck? How many times have I been it? Whining, complaining. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You tell me. I have no fucking idea. It's a, it's a garbage puzzle boss that's not fun. Yeah, if I knew what to do, I'd probably beat him on the first shot. Still not dead. What am I doing wrong now? What the fuck am I doing wrong? Online, what you're supposed to do. 
you're supposed to do because it's a puzzle. I've hit the thing five zillion times, I've hit its heart five zillion times, it won't die. It won't fucking die. Look at this. What's the point? Alright. I'm done. Until someone actually tells me how to beat it, I'm just gonna sit here with my hands folded. There's no point. It's a puzzle boss. There's no. Ch it's not challenging. It's a garbage puzzle. You don't know what to do. I'm exposing a tweet point. Unloading all my ammo into it is not dying. I don't care. Not until someone tells me what to do. I'm not going to play anymore. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is great. Oh my god. A demanding baby. What a baby. This guy constantly whining. Wah, wah. Oh my god, dude. Just shut up. <laughs> Just shut up and stop whining. Oh. Basically, here's a whiny baby. I'm not a whiny baby. I'm a mature adult. I'm just gonna sit here. I'm just gonna sit here. I'm not wasting more time. It's fucking boring. It's your fault, asshole. So apparently I'm being told I'm doing the fight correctly, but it takes insanely long to kill him on hardcore, just for no reason. Oh, you're on hardcore? Well, he has like five zillion health. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, I'm being told, get this. So you wait until he's at the top of the clock tower, shoot him right up there then, and then he'll fall from the very top, and it deals like maximum damage or something. Comma 94 took me five dollars, says, believe it or not, you're supposed to unload all you got into the boss of cutscene triggers when enough damage is given. Yeah, but I have no ammo left. I can't even get him to be stunned anymore. I have no more ammo to fight him. So it's not working. I'm stunning him, I'm shooting him in the heart, I don't have enough ammo to kill him, I don't have any grenades left. Without grenades, I can't- without any grenades, I can't get him off the tower. Right? Oh my god! Let's do this. No, you have no grenade rounds left! You have none left! Oh my god. That is fucking terrible. That was one of the worst boss fights ever designed in human history. Complete and utter fucking nonsense. Really poorly done. Insanely annoying. And now I have no ammo for the rest of the game. Because I wasted all my fucking ammo on that thing. That was fucking terrible. Puzzle boss 100%. Trash. I'm the lol cow. Dark side filled the lol cow. They call me a lol cow. Lol cow, lol cow. They just like to laugh and they, oh, he's the lol cow or whatever, right? And Phil's the lol cow of the gaming community. Phil has indoctrinated children who send him money. Blatantly milking for money. It's a money pit. It's gone. Just gone like that. In an instant, fucking gone. I just care about money. That I just can't help it. I eBay. Contributions are mandatory, but I need your help. I am appealing directly to you. No decency, no respect, no common sense, no fucking maturity. Is the guy who just doesn't get reality. <laughs>